I have a few. Um, I have a few awards that we'd like to get to quickly at, f at first because they were we were, we were very very fortunate to get a lot of uh, special awards funded, um, kind of at the last minute, but at the same time they're special awards anyways, and uh, we're very excited to uh, to have had those. Um, I'd like to start with the uh, Anita Day Memorial Student Award. And this was given by Potter Russell Sanchez. And this will go to Dylan Naranjo. Okay, there was an award for the uh, Pueblo Pottery Excellence Award, and this was awarded to Thomas Tenorio. Yes, yes. We have another special award. This was for the Okwa P Painting Award in Traditional Pueblo Style Painting, and this award is awarded to Thomas Tapia. We have a Tony Da Memorial Award. New Vision in Pueblo Pottery, and it was awarded to Russell Sanchez. A little further away? Okay. I'm an ex-rock star, so I put a right in my right in front of the I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, so the Amelia Youngblood Memorial Award for Best in Traditional Santa Clara Pottery is awarded to David Baca. Tafoya Memorial Award for Best in Traditional Santa Clara Pueblo Pottery was given to Nancy Youngblood. <laughs> we have the Serafina Tafoya Memorial Award for Best in Traditional Santa Clara Pueblo Pottery, 10 inches and under blackware. It goes to Madeline Naranjo. At this moment, I'd like to introduce a member from NIGA. His name is Jason Giles. I'd like to ask him to come to the stage, please. We have a new award category, and we'll have him talk a little bit about it this year. Thank you, thank you, and good afternoon. And on behalf of our chairman, Ernie Stevens, Jr., uh, National League Gaming Association, my name is Jason Giles. I'm the executive director. I'd like to introduce our treasurer is in attendance as well, Andy Yabona, Clinkett Haida Tribe from Alaska. <laughs> and, uh, I'm Muskogee Creek from Oklahoma, and this is a, a joy to be here today. And uh, we're here to introduce the Technology Award, or the Techie Award, and it's for art that does the best job of incorporating current technology. And we have a first, second, and honorable mention, as well as a youth category. So, uh, so we're gonna do the top techie for youth first place, and Anipkiwa White Eagle. I don't pass for me today. Okay. okay. And then for first place, for Techie Award, 97 Santa Fe Indian Market. And let's see, no name on here. goes to Barbie Raymond, Darby Raymond Overstreet. She <laughs> Did you want to talk to Darby? Did you want to speak a little bit yeah. about your piece? What tribe are you, Darby? Um, I am from the Navajo Nation. Yeah. Excellent. And we're
where can we find your piece? Uh, my piece is located in this corner on um, the back wall on the right. Well, excellent job, Darby. Thank Congratulations. you. Congratulations. Thank you, Jason. Thank, Thank you. you. And uh, on behalf of the National Gaming Association, we, we hope you come visit us at some point. Uh, we have a lot of events going on, so thank you again, sir, for this great honor. So thank thank you. you for coming. So I, I'm a little off, I got a little off script this morning. I got a little excited. So um, again, my name is Ira Wilson. I'm the new executive director. I had 26 years at the Indian Pueblo Culture Center before I was invited to come over to Swaya. And um, I'm trying to, you know, create something new, but still the same. Give many other people opportunities to be part and participate in the Santa Fe Indian Market. And I'd just like to say that uh, we'd like to thank IAIA for sponsoring this event. I don't know if, if Dr. Bob Martin is in the house. Uh, is Eric Davis in the house? Right on. Can you come up and say a few words, Eric? My oh, man, how are you? Hi, I'm Eric Davis. I'm the Director of Marketing and Communications for IAIA. It's a great pleasure to see you all here. I acknowledge we have some of our board members here, some of our special guests. Thank you all for coming. Um, as you all know, IAI is a very special place. And as you go through uh, market over the weekend, you will see the IAIA alumni banners on quite a number of booths. And we are just so happy to be with Ira and Swaya and put everything together. Special thanks to Amanda for all the help. Because without her, I'd be great. I'm sure you would too. Um, but we are, uh, we have our own award. Um, oh wait, no, not that yet. Not that yet? I'll come back up there. Okay, <laughs> we'll just let my sponsors talk then. Anyway, thank you all for coming. Um, you have a chance to stop by our museum. We have a lot of special activities and events at the IAI Museum of Contemporary Native Arts across the street from the cathedral. And please, if you can find time, come out to the campus and say hi. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so we're moving into uh, some of our larger awards, let's see. So we have the Peter Deckard Award, and this award will be presented to Mr. Timothy Smith. You here? No? Okay, the Helen Naha Memorial Award for Hopi Pottery. This goes to Karen Abeda. Is she here? No? I'd like to call um, Mr. Josh Rose up to the front, please. Where's Josh? Hey, Josh, how are you, man? I'd like to um, introduce yourself. Hello, uh, my name is Joshua Rose. I'm the editor of uh, Western Art Sector and Native American Art Magazine. We are proud to be the uh, official magazine for the market. Uh, we'll be yeah. And uh, so we give two awards, one for each magazine. Uh, the, uh, the Native American Art Magazine Editor's Choice Award goes to Jody Caldwell.
just around the corner. It was done by Adrian Finnegan's down here in our organization. And I'm here to introduce the
my handler over here. And artists, if she, if she does not get your, your photo with you, she will hunt you down. Trust me. Okay, so, best of classification in youth. Isaac Kohlmeier. Congratulations, Jeremy. Okay, so we have the Best of Classification Award for beadwork and quill work, Dalin Maybe. Okay. 
Okay, uh, Best of Classification Award for Diverse Arts, Kevin Poirier. Okay, so the best of classification award for textiles, which is his beautiful cheese blanket back here. The winner is Nellie Begay. I tried and tried to call her number yesterday. It rings once and it goes, and doesn't even go, it just goes straight to the voicemail. So I left her about 10 messages. Uh, we'll hopefully reach out to her real soon and she'll receive her award. Okay, so the best of classification award for sculpture goes to Teresa White.
stories he talks about how um, one of the women rose up and defended the village from invaders along with the help of um, the women and the children. And I think about in present times, we do have women warriors who stand up and fight against the invaders, whether it's environment or natural resources or corporations, they're, they're fighting off and they stand up and they rise up and they inspire the people to, to fight. And um, what Kevin was talking about, you know, um, Standing Rock and Oak Flat, and all of these different situations where the women were the ones who took that initiative and they were fearless and they were the ones who uh, led this resistance. And so I thought about those ideas and stories and, and incorporated those into the carving and um, it, 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 it came out exactly how I had envisioned it to be, so I was really happy. And um, I want to thank uh, SWAYA organization and um, I'd like to thank my wife and my family and, and uh, supporters that have been there. Um, this one's for uh, the warrior women. <laughs> Okay, this is the Best of Classification Award for paintings, drawings, graphics, and photography. Pieces right up here. We'd like to give this to Carol Romero. Flip it over and do the other half. <coughs> Hold it in my left hand. Put my hand in 
inside the bowl and then flip it, continuously flip it, because once you polish a piece, you can rub off the polish if you put it on something, a cloth. So I was very pleased with the way it came out. Um, this is my 44th Indian market. Um, I was doing Indian market when it was a little quaint show back in the day, and I come from a long line of potters. Uh, my grandmother, Margaret Tafoya, I remember watching her when I was 12 years old, showing a plaza with 70 other people. So it was a small show then. So I've seen it grow so much. And I want to thank everybody, all the volunteers. I know it's, you give them your time, and you don't really get a lot of thanks for it. And I just want to thank everybody for that. And Ira, welcome. I'm so glad to see you. And you too, Dallin. And that's all I have to say. Thank you. Thank you. Right over here, for the Best of Classification Award for Jewelry, such an amazing piece, I'd like to give you Mr. Farrell Pacheco. Thank you all. Have a great afternoon. 